Hi friends, now we are solving application of the Newton's law of cooling problem. Okay, suppose that an object is heated to 300 Fahrenheit and uh, to cool in a room whose air temperature is 80, degree, 80 Fahrenheit. After 10 minutes, the temperature of the object is 250 Fahrenheit. What is the temperature after 20 minutes is the given problem. To solve this problem, first we have to write the given data. An object uh, heated uh, at 300 uh, Fahrenheit. Ne? So, theta is equal to 300 Fahrenheit. Right. Room temperature. A room is here. Whose A temperature is how much? A temperature or surrounding temperature or room temperature we have to consider as a theta naught. What is the theta naught here we have means? That is... 80 and uh, after 10 minutes so if t this is when you have 300 initially initially so you consider as t is equal to 0 minutes after 10 minutes they given a mention clearly after 10 minutes so when t is equal to 10 minutes theta is how much we have 250 250 Fahrenheit right now what is the question they are asking means what is the temperature after 20 minutes so if t is equal to 20 minutes, then what is the temperature of the object? So they, they are asking theta. Here you see, due to the surrounding temperature, object temperature is cooling. So this is application of Newton's law of or Newton's law or not? Because due to the surrounding temperature, given object temperature is decreased. Okay now, so due to that one only, we can say this is application of the Newton's law of cooling. What is the Newton's law of cooling formula we have? Directly formula I am writing here. Theta is equal to theta naught plus C e to the power of minus kt. So to solve this, earlier videos also I mentioned clearly how to solve this type of the problems. First of all, you see given data. From the given data, we can secure C. Later on, later on in the step 2, we will get the value of k. In the step 3, you see theta naught you know. C value already you are getting from the step 1. K value also you are getting. Now, if t, t they gave, here t you know, c you know, k you know. Theta naught also you know. So what is the unknown now? Theta. Yes, theta you can find out. Suppose if they are given theta, you can also find out t. So here theta and t are unknowns in this problem up to two steps. Okay now? Right. Now, from the first step, what they gave? You see t is equal to 0. Step 1. Step 1, I am finding C value, for that I am using the given data, first one. So, substitute in 1, substitute in 1, then theta is equal to, is how much? 300, so 300 is equal to, theta naught is how much? 80 plus C, do you know? Don't know, C into e to the power of minus K, K do you know? No. So, T is how much? 0, 0 into K is 0 e power 0, minus 0 r plus 0 e power, okay, that is 1, c into 1, c, so c plus 80 is 300, then c is 300 minus 8, 300 minus 8 is how much, 220, so c value is how much, 220, now in the first step you got a uh, c, na? in the second step what you are going to get means k value, so how to find the k value means, use the given data and uh, what you have that data, from that what you secured this one, c value you know, na? given data is t is equal to 10 minutes, Theta is equal to 250 and theta naught is you have 80 and what you got here? C value. C is 220. Substitute in a 1. Substitute in these values. Substitute in 1. Then you will get you see theta. How much? 250. So 250 is equal to theta naught. How much? 80 plus C is 220. E to the power of minus K. Do you know K? Don't know. K is unknown here. T, T is how much? 10. So 10 times of K. So now you have to simplify. You see this is number, this is number. Means constant, constant. This is only unknown. So you, unknown is in right side. Na? So keep that one as it is. And the remaining you take left side. Then you see 250. This is plus 80. Na? So if you take a left side, what will happen? Minus 80. 250 minus 80 is nothing but how much? 170 is equal to. 200 multiple is there. Na? So you want e to the power of minus 10K as it is. The product is 220. Na? So, if you take a left side, what I will get? Divided by 220. That implies e to the power of minus 10k is equal to 17 by 22. Now, you need to simplify the k. Na? So, 
you have e power the k is in not a base but it is in powers e power so apply log on both side apply log means log e is 1 minus 10k is equal to log of 17 by 22 so k is equal to minus 1 by 10 times of log 17 by 22 if you want you can simplify by using the calculator you will get the k value otherwise you can keep a k value in terms of log only now what you want see in the problem what they given c value you got k value you got now unknown sir what you have t and theta what they gave t they gave so what is the unknown theta you can find out yes or no you have to substitute t is equal to 20 and theta not value is 80 c value is 220 and k value then you will get which value yes that is theta value you can get right now i am going to substitute these all values first i will write these all values okay t is equal to 20 theta naught is equal to 80 c is equal to 220 k is equal to minus 1 by 10 log of 17 by 22 earlier we got so we need to find theta what is the formula you have theta is equal to theta naught plus c e to the power of minus k d so we have to substitute these all values in this equation 1 this is equation 1 so if we substitute it, theta is equal to theta naught theta naught is 80 plus c 220 e to the power of minus k k is 1 by 10 minus of minus plus 1 by 10 times of log of 17 by 22 into t what is the t you have 20 20 can I write here this one here this is value now 20 so you have to simplify left side unknown is there right side uh, values are there so you can simplify these all values now yes so 80 plus 220 e to the power of 10 times of 1 10 times of 2 so 2 log 17 by 22 so m log a or n log a n log a you can also write as log e to the power of n similarly 80 plus 220 e to the power of log of 17 by 22 whole square that is 80 plus 220 e n log getting cancelled then you will have getting cancelled means you will get one power this is you see 17 by 22 whole square right now this one you have to simplify for that i am using calculator okay now you see this is i am using here 80 one second in the calculator you see what i gave 80 plus 220 times of 17 by 22 whole square so this value is equal to we have 2325 by 11 okay in decimal place what i will get means 211.3636 211.3636 okay round figure 211.4 i can consider right by using the calculator we have 211.36 i can consider as a round figure 4 so theta value means theta value is 211.4 when it is after 20 minutes the object temperature is this one like this we have to solve the problem